I have almost stopped raising turkeys. When I get them of a desirable plumpness, almost ready for the table, they have a propensity to wander from home, and my neighbor, who is turkey blind, claims them all. Our man of all work is a very black negro, about five feet in height and three feet in diameter, and of stolid and imperturbable good nature. A flock of turkeys that were his special pride had strayed from home, and after long search, he found them in my neighbor's turkey pen. The mother of the flock had her wings clipped, tall feathers pulled out, and red flannel tied around her legs. Yet, he recognized her under her disguises and brought her home victoriously. Why, Tom, I said, as I welcomed her back. I think you were very brave. Yes'm, he said modestly, but I left them pretty worthy over there. It is a mistake to think that country people have few temptations. The father of evil is just as busy here as he is in crowded cities. For instance, the distinction between meum and tuum is as apt to be blurred by self-interest here as elsewhere. I have known ordinarily good men and women, faithful communicants of the church, who could not resist claiming each other's turkeys when they happened to stray from home. 